인간 유전학자인 헌터 박사는 염색체 이상에 관심이 많다. 여성이 나이가 들수록 염색체 이상의 아이를 가질 위험이 높아지는 원인에 대해 연구하다 우연히 비스페놀 A가 난자에 영향을 주는 것을 발견했다고 한다. And this happens right before the egg is ovulated. And so we were trying to look at that time point. And what we saw is instead of all lining up nicely, they were kind of misaligned and you know, looking like they were making errors, which in fact then we could follow them and see that they were making errors and making chromosomally abnormal eggs. Maybe the monkey wants to be there too. This is one egg. Okay. It should develop with cells all around it like this. Mm. Here's another egg with cells around it. This is what happens with bisphenol A, many eggs all developing in one package instead of separate little packages. One egg into one. 하나만 발달해야 할 난자가 한꺼번에 발달되어 수정을 할수 없는 기형의 난자가 되고 말았다. But it's a very different process in males and females. Interestingly, we now have a strong effect of BPA and other many other chemicals in the male. But it's completely different than the female because it doesn't cause chromosomally abnormal sperm. What it does is it causes mistakes that are stopped in the process of making a sperm. So they're killed. Well, that sounds like a really good thing, doesn't it? Except that if you kill enough cells, you actually drop the sperm count. You reduce the number of sperm that that male makes.